today with a new video and I'm going to show you guys today's subject is how to paint your house and style it under $30 and it's a very unique part I'm really sorry guys because I have already started doing it and I forgot to make a clip in the beginning but I'll kind of put some pictures I have taken pictures before and after so I still I left some of the part for you guys uh, it's pretty easy you can design a very nice painting style under $30 so I'm gonna show you guys how I did it and what you guys will gonna need instead of spending a lot of money to going to the market and getting each and every color or doing some of you guys maybe are smart enough to do that but it's for the people like who doesn't know or they don't know how to spend like the labor charge is too much you can do it yourself actually and you can save a lot of money with that part let me show you what did I do and I'll show you the pictures what I did and I'm going to show you now I'm going to complete the rest of the part how I'm going to do, do that basically I started like uh, I the initial plan was I'm going to just paint uh, water based color on my walls because my younger kid he whenever he grabs a pencil or a pen he starts like scratching over the walls so I just wanted to erase those things but later on I realized like why don't I try something else so I came up with something which turned out to be a very good thing now I wanted to show you guys how I did it and what do you guys need actually to do that so let me show you what you guys actually need to do that all right let's get it on in this video I'll try to make it as short as possible so you guys gonna come to the bottom line how it can be done like my channel says travel cook and save money so this is basically a part of save money how you guys can do wonders with saving tons of money let's get it on guys let's get it on all right you're gonna need I initially bought uh, off-white you can buy a uh, white paint as well it's a plastic base but like not plastic it's a water based color emulsion uh, you can buy a uh, five gallons of this one in Saudi Arabia like it will gonna cost you near about 60 reals and at the same time I bought like when I was about to do that I thought of myself like why don't I buy these colors so these are the basically colors like green black pink and yellow uh, these are the different colors uh, you're gonna need you're gonna need whoop, fell down the cup and we're gonna need this one later on this will cost you near about five reals it's a roller you're gonna need it later on a small brush also costs you near about five reals this thing also costs you near about five reals as well this is a filler actually where you have like the screw holes where you or any cracks you want to fill it up so you can use this one and I had a old scaper at my home so I used the same one so I filled it up basically I didn't need any of these but anyhow still there are some holes which I'm going to do it later on and there are some tapes paper tapes you're gonna need I'll show you in a minute uh, which you're gonna need like five pieces of tape cost me near about five reals as well so let me show you guys which tape I used it it's one inch thick tape wider like and uh, that's it and let's take you to the to the place where I painted initially and where the paints are left I left with the yellow one actually I'm going to use it because one wall I painted pink and uh, pink with the gray and green gray color actually I couldn't find it in the market so basically in the beginning what I did was like I made it a lot of green color and by mistake I put it a big in a big bucket so I didn't know what to do so I added up a black in the green so it turned out a very nice gray color which I'm gonna show you in the pictures later on so I used it even there was enough paint 
to cover my outside wall where I do the barbecue. It was a very dirty wall and also with the smoke it was getting like uh, darker and darker every day. So now I did it gray so at least the gray is not going to do any much damage with this like it will not gonna get damaged with the smoke. So let me show you guys uh, how I did that and I'll show you while painting this yellow color the leftover in that place where and the end results I'm gonna show you. Now I'm gonna take you to the wall where I did the initial painting and I'll show you the tape which I used it. It's paper tape they call it usually and they use it uh, while repainting the vehicles as well. In US you got better tapes even. I don't know in the US you get this big gallon or not because this is a five gallon, five US gallons uh, bucket where you can add up uh, like four liters of water and you can like do two coatings I did two coatings on each box, which I made it a colorful box, so it was pretty easy. So let's take you guys there and show you what is the leftover part. And I'll show you the tape as well. All right, this is the tape which I used to make the design. Uh, five of these you're gonna need. I don't know like how long the tape is. But uh, the guy who sold me out, he told me it's near about 10 to 12 meters. So I don't know exactly whether it was 10 to 12 meters because I've used it like near about almost each and every tape. This is the only part left. Like I brought five of these for five rails. It's pretty cheap actually. So guys, it's under $100. It's under $100. Not, not $100, sorry. <laughs> $30. $100, $100, $100, I mean to say. So... I'll show you guys the results and I'll show you guys the leftover part which I left it for you guys to see what did I do and uh, what are the outcome results on it. Stay tuned. Let's go there and see the colors. So this is what I did. The initial finish you can see uh, with these three colors only. Actually, this is a side of my daughter's bed, so I'm going to show you the other side now, which is incomplete and I'm going to complete it for you guys. Uh, with the yellow left in it. So this is a part which needs to be finished. I already taped the same tape which I showed you guys. I'm going to repaint and now I'm going to fill in all these white boxes into yellow. And I'll show you the end results. How did I do that? And let's show you another part. And after that, I'm going to have enough paint left, actually, to paint the rest of the house. So stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. I'll show you the other place which I'm working on. All right. This is the another wall which is like left. I need to fill in the yellows so let's get it on without any further ado we'll start painting the yellow one and that's it guys you can save a lot of money under $30 you can paint this kind of design or you can make your own design however you like it so I'm gonna put next pictures I'm gonna put I won't gonna put my working in it so you can see the end results all right then see you guys with the results now Alrighty guys, I'm going to make the yellow color now, the final one, and after that I'm going to do the regular work. So this is how it comes, like the paint, it's a full thick off-white color, you can add up the water, and then hardly I used it from it guys. So I'm going to dirty myself up now, Let's open it up. I'm using this tea cup, tea paper cup to get the paint out of it. So I'm gonna make enough for two coats in each box, the places which I showed you. One more. 
in case like that. First, we are going to add up the water and stir it well. So I brought a disposable plate. We're going to put it in that one. Got close to it with the bag. It came along like that, but it, meant it was not like tight enough. Except the seat on top we were having. Alrighty. Now what we are going to do is add the yellow in here. Let me get myself a napkin. You to clean my hands. And I've got something to stir the color. All right, guys, let's add up a little bit of water. And start to, I'm using the old broken broomstick. To mix it up so let's do it until it gets thicker and add up the color and stir it again let's add up the yellow color and check it out how turns out to be wow wow but it is gonna come back again to you off white we're gonna need to add up again because I've done it yesterday even with the pink one and the gray one it was the same case now it looks like very dark yellow but now after stirring it for a couple of like seconds it's gonna turn out again a lighter version of it we need to add up again so let's see. Okay, a little more. Let's put it on because we're going to need a darker shade. This costs you five reals only, which is one point five dollars. So let's go to the wall and try the color okay guys now the thing is uh, you need to make sure it's thick enough and mixed well enough which will take up to like two coats and you can cover all the part the whiteness and everything on the wall Let's go to the wall in now. Finally, we have finished our coating, which I have done it twice. So the moment of truth, I'm going to take off the tapes to show you guys the final results. Here goes nothing.
All right, guys, this was it. So the results are in front of you. I'll take off the tapes from the other the tapes from the other room as well and I'll show you. So this is the final thing. I hope you guys like it. Let's take it out from inside the room now. This is it guys, I'm going to remove the final tape, I don't want to make a longer video because it's already like, we're going to go up more than like 15-16 minutes now, so that's it I believe, this was the final one, hope you guys like it, the final results, alright guys take care, this is your host. I should have said ciao for now. Bye bye.
this is it guys I'm going to remove the final tape I don't want to make a longer video because it's already like we're gonna go up more than like 15 16 minutes now so that's it I believe this was the final one hope you guys like it the final results all right guys take care this is your host Kasha Singh. Ciao for now. Bye bye.